Giordano's time is at hand. Giordano Bruno Rabbit says the judge, you stand accused of blasphemy. How say ye? Giordano rises, nods to the judge, and then faces the jury. Honorable judge, members of the jury, what I have to say is hard but true. God is not a rabbit. Pandemonium, shouts. Members of the jury with noses twitching furiously. He admits the charge, shouts the prosecutor. Why listen to more blasphemy when his own words convict? Finally, the court comes to order. Giordano Rabbit stiffens. He will speak the truth, no matter the cost. Hear me, good rabbits. We know today that the great mother rabbit, holy be her name, did not begin the world by birthing a million rabbits from her blessed womb. She allowed natural processes to produce us in time. And speaking of time, we know our planet is billions of years old, not thousands. He denies she and her holy writings, shouts the prosecutor, stamping his hind legs. His guilt is plain. What need is there to hear more? It is my right, says Giordano. I will not be denied. All look to the judge. After a long pause, he says, you may continue, Giordano Bruno Rabbit, but I would advise the defendant to be mindful of the consequences. Those who deny the truth have more to fear than those who declare it, says Giordano defiantly. The courtroom falls silent. Finally, in a pleading, conciliatory tone, Giordano continues. Good rabbits, hear my words. When our species was in its infancy, our great mother rabbit, holy be her name, allowed various stories to circulate, stories which gave us a warm, snug egg for our minds to inhabit. But in seeking the truth, we've learned better. We've seen the cracks in the egg, and we have seen through to the wondrous world beyond a world vast beyond measure, teeming with wonders yet to be discovered. Some of us have come to see the great mother rabbit as a personification of something infinitely greater, infinitely more wondrous. But others have grown too accustomed to their snug mental cocoon, so they seal the cracks. They make an idol of the holy writings and reject the vast, wonderful truth, clinging to ancient truth which erodes daily before our very eyes. God takes the form of a rabbit to accommodate us. Do not the arachnids say their God spun the web of the entire universe from herself? But God is infinitely beyond arachnid ideas and infinitely beyond rabbit ideas. She, or he, or it, I know not which, awaits our discovery. We need only venture outside our egg into the wonderful sunlight of truth and follow the truth as best we are able. We must put away childish things and enough interrupts the judge. Giordano Bruno Rabbit, the jury will now decide your fate. And may our great mother rabbit, holy be her name, have mercy on your soul.